Hello YouTube world, this is Gene with Dink Over Stink Catfishing. In today's video, we're going to be going over how I will be attempting to change the colors on my Smackdown rod holders. So if you have a set already laying around or if you plan on getting you a set in the future and they may not have the color combo you're going to go with, you may try this. I'll be using the uh, Blaze Pink. This is the spray can version. They do have a dip can version also. Um, first, you want to start off, or how I did, I started off by getting the rod holders, getting your washcloth and some rubbing alcohol, clean them up really well, make sure there's no dirt, grease, or oils on them, and stuff like that. Uh, stuck them down this picnic bench right here to give a good place to paint. Let's get started and see how this goes. Thanks for watching. Karma, you want spray painted? Boo. You want some spray paint? <laughs> well, like I say, that, this first coat's gonna be light, a light coat. Alrighty. There's the first coat. Turned out a really, really nice pink so far. I'm sure it'll darken just a little bit on the next coat or two. So we'll probably put two to three coats on this. Three for sure, or two for sure, three probably. And then we bought some, also bought some Plastid Dip uh, Glossifier we're gonna put on there to give it a little bit of shine and to, to keep it from fading out as, as quick. Let's see what happens. Let's all right, we let this dry for 30 minutes. We're gonna give this the second and third coat. Let's get her done. All right, we got the three coats on there. And as you can see, it looks really, really good so far. Um, if you do wanna protect the, uh, the Dion fluorescent paint color a little bit and have put a little gloss um, finish on there, I bought some of this. It's the Plastic Dip Flexible Glossifier Coating. We're gonna put a little coat of this on there to, uh, to protect it all and then give it a little shine on there. Okay, so since the pink ones turned out so well, I decided to go ahead and take my green ones and uh, clean them up and go with yellow. But since I'm going to go with yellow over green, I went ahead and figured I'd get me a coat of white and give them a light coat of white first so I can be able to cover up the green color a little bit better and get that nice yellow shine out of it. Let's see how it works. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is the final product installed on the boat. As you can see, well, they turned out pretty. I like them, uh, they turned out good. The coating went on really well. They matched my uh, Ancient Mariner rods very, very well. Only time will tell if the durability of this plastic dip is gonna last or not. But as far as right now, I have dropped one. <laughs> I'll be honest, I've dropped one of them on the way in here in the gravel. Didn't do nothing to it, so. I think with just the, the use of rods in there and being left on a boat, I think we're going to be in good shape. But uh, I'll show you guys what the final product looks under the black light. Gene with Dink Over Stink Catfishing. Thanks for tuning in.